As green flag will fly, we are underway. Heat race number one. And it will be John Cornell showing the way off a of turn at number two, followed by an 81 B machine of Bud Grossenbacher in that second spot. This 22B of Bruce Duggan as Nate Warren almost slapped the wall, coming off a of turn number four with 78 Steve Stoltz. He'll go by him. So John Cornell trying to pull away, but the 81B of Grossenbacher not letting it happen. As Cornell right now has about a three-car length advantage over the 81B of Grossenbacher. Now it's going to be stretched out to about eight car lengths as Cornell. He's yarded the 81B machine of Grossenbacher. Duggett still in that third spot, followed by Schultz in fourth. Nate Warren is fifth. Paul Rios right now running in the sixth position. Your final car here for this first heat race of the night is Bobby Engel Realty heat race. Looks like Paul Rios will take it off the racetrack. So it looks like his heat race is done. Hopefully get things fixed, booted, and suited and back out for the main event later on this evening as they will go 25 laps here tonight for the SRD late models. Right now out front, it's all John Cornell. Cornell was bested by his teammate Craig Parker last time here at Arizona Speedway just two weeks ago. Then last week had the double header of course uh, saturday night got rained or sunday night got rained out saturday it was john cornell who parked it in victory lane as bud grossenbacher right now running in the second spot followed by nate warren in th or followed by bruce duckett excuse me in third steve stoltz nate warren in fifth as the white flag will fly this next time for John Cornell as he has himself a comfortable eight car length advantage over Bud Grossenbacher going into turn at number one. He can start to stretch his legs out off turn two as Bruce Duggan had a big moment there off of turn number four. Big wiggle. That's going to make a battle for third now between him and Steve Stoltz. So we'll follow your race leader as he comes through three and four. John Cornell, he'll win heat race number one for the Stewart area late models over Bud Grossenbacher. But it will be Stoltz and Duckett duking it out for that third spot. Give it to the 22B of Duckett over Steve Stoltz. Nate Warren comes home in fifth. And green flag is in the air. We're underway. And Craig Parker, your most recent main event winner here at Arizona Speedway, picking up where he left off just two weeks ago. That's out front as the battle is on for second, though. Brian Schultz looks underneath 89 and Lang. Now will be Lang and Brad Williams, both blowing by the outside of that L8 machine of Schultz. As Williams goes underneath James Lang, as Lang's kind of stepped on up there, calling for turn number two. Now Schultz makes a little contact with the 89 machine of Lang. Lang, though, trying to fight back on the inside. He'll wash up the racetrack, throw the slider on the L8 machine of Schultz. So James Lang, Brian Schultz providing the entertainment here in heat race number two for that third spot. As out front, it is all Craig Parker showing the way with Brad Williams in second, followed by Lang. Schultz, and it will be the 107 machine of Kelly Johnson rounding out your top five with Brett Hedgeman, driver out of Paul Dean, Arizona, in six. So Craig Parker still showing the way. He has about a 12-car length advantage right now over the 23 machine of Brad Williams. Williams in that right now holding pretty steering wheel in second. We'll see if... Uh, does a little fine tuning later on, gets that thing booted and suited for the main event. Should be a force to be reckoned with here tonight. That number 23 is Brian Schultz and James Lang. They have exchanged third and fourth spots once again with Schultz moving up to that third position. James Lang, though, going to try to reel him back in. About two car lengths separates them after they work off a of turn at number two into turn number three. Schultz and Lang both work on the cushion through turns three and four as Kelly Johnson catfishes on the bottom as your race leader, Craig Parker, now coming into the screen off of turn number four. He's going to be looking for the white flag this time here in heat race number two. So Craig Parker leads him off of turn number two one final time down the back straightaway using the high line, holding that thing high, wide, and handsome. It's the 48 of Craig Parker, most recent main event winner. He'll win heat race number two. Over the 23 of Brad Williams, the one or the L8 of Brian Schultz, 89 of James Lang, and the 107 of Kelly Johnson.